Hello my brothers and sisters and welcome to another special episode of Chris the Butcher and Friends. Yes, I say special because this is brought to you by Spice and Easy, right? There it is. Don't click it, it's not a link, right? Don't be going... <laughs> it not doing nothing, Chris. Right? It's gone. Spice and Easy. This little channel on YouTube... That, and they also have a business where they sell spice mixes. And I've got this. Where is it? There we go. They sent me three of these. I don't know what's walking into that tripod, on They sent me three of these. I've got a liquid fire. I've got two others, which I'm going to tell you about. Because this is part one of my spice and easy. And this one is going to be beef. Liquid fire. Now, if you want to purchase these... I will put the link to their website in the description. Also, I'll put the link to their YouTube channel in the description. And I, I expect you all to show him some support. Hit that subscribe button for him. Tell him I sent you. And they're going at 310 at the minute. And they, they need to get building. Come on. It's called Alan and his missus. Alan likes a drink like me. But he gets far worse. Absolutely wankered. On live streams, ten times wankeder than me. Wankeder. Is that is that even a word, love? Look. Wankeder. Is that a word? If you want it to be, yeah. If I want it to be, what do you mean? It either is or isn't. Get the Oxford Dictionary, woman. Well, is gizzard a word? Fucking right it is. So this is where we started. I don't even know it's got two pans, right? Because I'm following Spice and Easy's absolutely down to the T instructions. Now I've got some finely chopped onions. It says one medium to large onion, finely chopped. So that's going in. Uh, I did have that pan quite sizzling, but shit happened and I had to, uh, I had to stop what we're doing. So... We've got uh, it definitely on, you can see. So we're going to get them softened up. Get them going for a couple of minutes, and then we're going to add, in our other pan over there, we're going to add our meat, which I've got some nice big chunks of uh, beef. And we're going to have that in there any second. Now the onions are doing the thing, we're going to sear off our meat. Nice big chunks. You know what I mean? I don't want to piss around with little bits of shit so this will probably won't take it long at all really beautiful beautiful pieces of steak oh so that pan right now as well isn't tennis but I'm going to add a bit of salt quickly so that's end Ed. oh it's snowing in done Right, I'll keep stirring these onions and uh, we'll get this meat seared off, shall we? Well, that's our meat, our beef, seared. Beautiful, look at that. So I'm going to put that to one side now, I'll drain it and uh, we'll crack on with that. Brothers and sisters, we have got our onions ready. And we're now going to hit it with our liquid fire seasoning mix from Spice and Easy. Now, it says empty the entire sachet in there, all right, which I have done. Whoop, bug it off. Uh, a splashes of water, apparently. I don't want to, I don't, uh, there's quite a bit of stuff in the bottom of that pan, you know. Juices and, you know, liquid from the, 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 uh, Onions. Now, yes, that's going to need a bit more water. Uh, I need to stir this until it becomes a paste. 
Right, I think that might do it. So while I crack on here, uh, we'll be back. Uh, I probably will be adding a bit more, but in fact, yeah, I need a bit, a bit more water. It said splashes of water. I'll tell you what, the fumes coming off this right now are, are quite powerful. I think I need an hazmat suit and a, a gas mask. Right, be back to you then, very, very short, shortly, shortly, shortly. Hey, don't call me Shirley. Now it's time for the tomato puree. About, he said about, they say about 50 grams. That's just over a quarter of this. So that will do it. And now I've got to stir this in as well. Right. One minute. All I'm going to say at this point is, my eyes are fucking burning me. And it's gone right on my chest. Right, 400 grams of chopped tomatoes are going in. Give that a quick stir. We will do this live. We'll do this quick time. Quick view, live view, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Right? Get that stirred in and then we're going to go in straight away. I presume that's what it says. With half a pint of water. Which I have here. So, we'll get that stirred in. Let it incorporate. Let it come back up to heat, because I've put, put cold water in there, haven't I? By the way, it didn't specify, I've done this all on a medium heat. Because you don't want to burn anything, do you? Oh, God, it's hurting the back of my throat already. I, I, I can fucking hit it. Right. Give it a couple of minutes, and uh, the next thing is we're putting our uh, meat back in our beef. So uh, I'll come back when we do that. Our beef's going in now. Get it poured in. There we are. Want to get that covered as well. Want to get it incorporated in that sauce. Uh, liquid fire beef curry. Curtis is spice and easy. Right. I'm going to simmer that now. I don't know. I don't know how long. It says on the instructions to your desired uh, consistency. Uh, I quite like it a bit thick, so I think I'm going to simmer that. In fact, I'm going to turn it. I'm going to turn it down one more. Right, I'm going to simmer that now for about 15 minutes, and uh, throw it on some rice and slide it down my gizzard. So, my brothers and sisters, there it is. That is my spice and easy liquid fire beef curry. Now, I, it hurt me when I was. When I was cooking it, it hurt my eyes, it got on my chest. So I can imagine this is going to be rather hot. So we'll get a bit of rice. And we definitely want to get a bit of that juice in there, don't we? Let's just get it down my gizzard. Right, the first thing I'm getting is it's really, really tasty. My God, that is good. That is... Taste fantastic. It's burning it back in my throat a little bit. I was gonna bite that beef. Look at that. Mmm. Oh yeah. Mmm. That is superb, brothers and sisters. It does tell you on it, very hot curry. Now, this to me, it's hot, right? But everyone knows I've got great tolerance with heat. And that, oh, spice and easy. That is absolutely superb. That is absolutely superb. The taste, everything. The spices. The beef I put with it. 
I can't put it down. <coughs> it's, uh, it's coming through. I'm starting. My glasses are starting to slide off my face right now. Oh God. The meat you put with it, you know, I mean, you can put what you want with it. I chose beef for this. I've got three sachets to do. Three different videos to do. So I wanted, what I wanted to do was use three different meats for the three different curries. Oh, fuck me. Mm. That is mighty fucking fine. My brothers and sisters, that was spice and easy liquid fire beef curry. And the taste of that was superb, right? Spice and easy. Link will be in the description to their YouTube channel. I expect you to hit it, ring their bell, tell them I sent you, right? They need all the help they can get. They got about 310, like I said before. They might have a few more, they might have a couple less, I don't know. But listen, I'll also, in the description, I will link their website address where you can buy these sachets. Listen, they're dirt cheap. And I think postage is only £1.50, right? You can't go wrong. Listen, the ingredients. I had the sachet, all I needed was the bit, the bit of meat, uh, some chopped tomatoes, some tomato puree and some fucking onions. That's it. Dirt cheap, and what I made there will serve four people. Uh, even though there's only me eating it. I'm going to pot the rest up and take it work and uh, get right and eat it, the fucking fat bastard. <laughs> yes, so spice and easy. Thank you very much. That was so much appreciated, but that is only part one. We've got two more parts to do yet. And that'll come over in the next couple of months, I suppose. So anyway, I liked it, I loved it, I liked it. If you liked it, press like, comment, share in all your social media, and subscribe. And become a family member of Hashtag Team CTP, where I fucking love you.